Hi, welcome back. In this video, I will discuss how to write a Java program to check whether the given number is prime or not. So uh, we can say a given number is prime if it is uh, divisible by itself or one. If it is divisible by any other number, then a number is not called as a prime number. So what we do here is uh, we will create a main class first. Uh, I have named the main class as uh, prime number. Next, uh, we will add a main method here that is uh, public static void main and then string args. Next, within this particular uh, main method, uh, we will create uh, some local variables. Let us say that uh, int n, uh, which will store uh, the number to be checked whether it is a prime or not. And then uh, we will take one flag variable. Let us say that the value of uh, flag is equal to zero. The meaning is the given number is prime. If the flag value is set to one, the meaning is uh, the given number is not a prime number in that case. Now uh, we need to read some uh, input from the keyboard. So we will create an object of a scanner class that is a scanner in is equal to new scanner. We will pass a parameter that is system dot in in this case. System dot in. Now uh, we were able to create uh, the scanner uh, object here but uh, we will get an error here because we have not imported a scanner class so we will import it by clicking this one uh, you can see here import java util dot scanner in this case now uh, i will give a very simple message to the user like uh, system dot out dot print ln like uh, enter the number uh, which is to be checked like whether it's a given uh, prime or not now uh, we have to store that particular number into a variable that is n uh, that is uh, you can say that i n dot and next int in this case Now uh, we will check whether this particular n is uh, prime or not. Uh, to check whether n is prime or not, uh, this condition is very simple. Uh, it should not be divisible by any other number except uh, one or uh, uh, itself. So we will take one simple for loop that is uh, for int i is equal to 2 I will start because uh, uh, divisible by 1 is acceptable. So I will take i is equal to 2 i is less than uh, n in this case because uh, divisible by n is also acceptable so less than n i will take i plus plus so if uh, n is divisible by anything in the range of 2 to n to less than n you can say the meaning is it is uh, not a prime number so we can check that condition with the help of uh, modulus operator that is uh, n mod i is equal to 0 if n mod i is equal to 0 the meaning is flag i will set to 1 that is uh, the given number is uh, divisible by anything in the range of 2 to less than n in this case so if it is divisible by any other number the n is not a prime number that is as simple as that uh, because it is divisible by any one number it is not a prime number we have set it equal to 1 here now uh, we will break and then come out of this particular loop here if the given number is not divisible by any number in the range of 2 less than n, this flag will never be set to 1. The meaning is the given number is prime in that case. So once this particular loop is over, we will check this particular condition whether flag is equivalent to 1. If the flag is equivalent to 1, we will give a message like system dot out dot print ln. Uh, you can say that n is not a prime number because uh, you can say that uh, the value of that particular flag will be set to 1 only when it is divisible by any number in the range of 2 to less than n here. If this flag is not set to 1, the meaning is the given number is divisible is not divisible by any other number 
it is a prime number in that case so n is a prime number here so this is a simple message we will print in this case so the program is very simple first we have created a scanner object so that we can read something from the keyboard once we read the number we will start from 2 less than n we will check whether it is divisible by any other number or not if it is divisible we will set flag equals to 1 and then come out of this loop once we finish this particular loop we will check whether flag is equal to 1 or not if it is equal to 1 the meaning is uh, it is not a prime number if it is equal to 0 the meaning is the given number is prime in this case now uh, we will run and see whether the program is working fine or not uh, right click select run as and then java application uh, yeah if it is uh, working fine it will ask you to enter the number so i will enter a number as 8 and then i will press enter button it will say that 8 is not a prime number we will try for another number let us say that uh, the number is uh, 11 now uh, it says that 11 is a prime number in this case of course 8 was not a prime number and 11 is a prime number in this case so i will use one space here so that uh, we will be able to get the proper output in this case so this is a very simple program to check whether a given number is uh, prime or not uh, i hope the program is clear if you have any questions you can put those questions in the comment box if you like the video do like and share with your friends press the subscribe button for more videos Press the bell icon for regular updates. Thank you for watching.